Finally, after 14 years, Chandigarh Metro materializes, the Chandigarh Tricity Metro project. The urban landscape of Chandigarh, Mohali, and Panchkola is poised for a groundbreaking transformation, as per news reports of December 12, 2023, with the recent revelation of the proposed 114 km metro network that is set to redefine public transportation in the Tricity. The eagerly awaited alignment option report, meticulously crafted by Rail India Technical and Economic Services, writes, unveils a visionary plan that predominantly features elevated tracks and stations. This alignment option report, submitted to the UT administration, marks a watershed moment in the region's urban development and would be the catalyst for a new era of connectivity and mobility in the region. This video and its thorough analysis will delve into the multifaceted impacts that the elevated metro network is poised to have on Chandigarh, Mohali, and Panchkula, encompassing social, business, economic, environmental, and employment dimensions. Hi friend! Welcome to SciTech Buzz channel. Please remember to subscribe to this channel after viewing this video. Kindly watch this until the end in order to receive all the details of this interesting video. Chronicle of the Metro Vision The report delineates three corridors as part of Phase 1, intricately weaving through Chandigarh, Mohali, and Panchkola. The Madhya Marg Corridor stands out, emerging as the crown jewel of the project, with a fully elevated track. Meanwhile, the other two corridors will blend the elevated and underground components, harmonizing with the urban fabric and topography. The first phase, spanning a total of 89 kilometers, comprises three routes that promise to alleviate the Tricity's traffic burdens. The routes include Peral, New Chandigarh, Sarangapur SBT Panchkula to Panchkula Extension, Rock Garden to Zirikpur ISBT via Industrial Area and Airport, and from Grain Market Chowk, Sector 39, to Transport Chowk, Sector 26. With a hopeful commencement of the project in April 2024 and completion targeted for 2034, the first phase is set to be a game-changer. Technical Marvels and Strategic Planning According to the Wrights Report, the majority of tracks and stations in the first two corridors will ascend into the sky, offering commuters a unique and elevated perspective of the Tricity. This innovative approach not only enhances efficiency but also minimizes disruptions to existing infrastructure. The third corridor, tracing the path between Sector 26 and Sector 39 along Madhya Mark, stands as a testament to architectural prowess, boasting a fully elevated stretch. In the projected Phase 2, spanning 25 kilometers and anticipated post-2034, the metro's reach will extend further. The proposed routes from Airport Chowk to Manikpur Kalar, 5 kilometers, and ISBT Zirikpur to Pinjara, 20 kilometers, will continue the trend of a predominantly elevated network, ensuring a seamless flow of transportation across the Tricity. Governmental Nod and Collaborative Efforts UT advisor Nitin Yadav expressed optimism, stating, We have received the report. Within a week, we will be holding a meeting of the 23-member Unified Metro Transportation Authority, UMTA. We are expecting that the AAR and DPR will be ready by January next year and work on the ambitious project will begin in April. The financial blueprint of this colossal undertaking reveals a collaborative effort, with Haryana and Punjab contributing 20% each, the center pitching in another 20%, and the remaining 60% sourced from a lending agency. This financial synergy reflects a shared commitment to address the burgeoning traffic challenges and enhance the overall quality of life in the Tricity. Reviving Metro Dreams, a Triumph Over Adversity This ambitious metro project has weathered storms of skepticism and bureaucratic hurdles. The roots of the Metro Vision were planted in 2009, only to face rejection in 2017 due to concerns raised by the Home Ministry. MP Kuro Kerr's opposition in 2014 added another layer of complexity to the narrative. After years in cold storage, the Metro plans were revitalized in August 2021. The UT administration, 
determined to overcome past setbacks, enlisted rights to formulate a fresh comprehensive mobility plan. This decision was a strategic move to address the escalating traffic problems in a city burdened with 14 lakh registered vehicles and a daily influx of over 2 lakh interstate vehicles. Social reshaping, fostering community integration. The Metro Network's predominantly elevated design holds significant social implications. Beyond the convenience of swift travel, elevated stations become architectural landmarks that contribute to the city's identity. The envisaged connectivity across diverse neighborhoods promotes social cohesion, breaking down spatial barriers and fostering a sense of shared community. Accessibility becomes a cornerstone for inclusivity, with elevated stations designed to accommodate people of all abilities. This deliberate focus on social inclusivity ensures that the benefits of the metro network are accessible to a broad spectrum of the population, reinforcing the idea that urban development should be synonymous with societal progress. Business and Economic Upturn, Catalyst for Growth The impact on local businesses and the broader economy is poised to be profound. With the metro seamlessly connecting major commercial hubs like Rock Garden, industrial area, and airport, the ease of commuting is expected to attract a surge in footfall. Elevated stations in these key locations not only facilitate smoother passenger movement but also serve as commercial hotspots, offering opportunities for retail spaces, eateries, and various services. Moreover, the reduction in travel time due to the metro's swift and efficient operation is anticipated to unlock economic productivity. Businesses, unburdened by the constraints of traffic congestion, can operate more efficiently, translating into tangible economic gains for the region. The enhanced connectivity is likely to attract new investments and businesses, creating a virtuous cycle of economic growth. Environmental Sustainability – A Breath of Fresh Air in a region grappling with vehicular congestion and escalating pollution levels, the metro emerges as a harbinger of environmental sustainability. The elevated tracks, by minimizing the need for extensive land acquisition and reducing surface-level disruption, exemplify a thoughtful approach to urban development. The shift towards public transportation, powered by electricity, aligns with global sustainability goals and positions the Tricity as a responsible urban center. The potential reduction in vehicular traffic, especially given Chandigarh's status as having the highest density of vehicles per household in the country, will contribute to lower carbon emissions and improved air quality. The Metro project, therefore, transcends being merely a transportation initiative, it becomes a cornerstone for a greener, more environmentally conscious urban landscape. Employment Opportunities, Wheels of Progress in Motion The construction and subsequent operation of the Metro Network are expected to generate a surge in employment opportunities. The ambitious project, with a tentative cost of 11,000 Indian rupees crore, will require a skilled workforce across various domains, from engineering and construction to operations and maintenance. The ripple effect extends beyond the immediate project, as the enhanced connectivity catalyzes economic activities. Local businesses and service providers, from maintenance crews to security personnel, will witness an uptick in demand for their services. This surge in employment not only addresses immediate economic needs but also contributes to skill development and capacity building in the region. Strategic Governance, Navigating Past Challenges for Future Progress the Metro Project's journey, marked by challenges and rejections in the past, reflects the resilience of strategic governance. The decision to revive the Metro plans in 2021, guided by a comprehensive mobility plan by rights, showcases an adaptive and forward-thinking approach by the UT administration. The inclusive decision-making process, involving stakeholders from Haryana and Punjab, signals a collaborative commitment to overcome past roadblocks. The approval and extension of the Tricity Metro project by the 23-member Unified Metro Transportation Authority, UMTA, underscore the significance of collaborative governance.
This shared vision and coordinated effort lay the foundation for a transformative urban infrastructure that aligns with the evolving needs of the region. Conclusion, Riding the Wave of Transformation As the Tricity eagerly awaits the realization of its metro dreams, the proposed elevated network stands as a beacon of progress. The proposed elevated metro network in Chandigarh Tricity represents more than a transportation infrastructure upgrade. It signifies a paradigm shift in urban living, intertwining convenience, sustainability, economic prosperity, and social integration. As the region braces itself for the unfolding chapters of this transformative saga, the elevated metro emerges as a symbol of progress, resilience, and the collective will to shape a future where connectivity is not just a means of travel but a catalyst for holistic development. The rights crafted plan promises not only to ease traffic congestion but also to foster economic development, environmental sustainability, and improved accessibility for the residents of Chandigarh, Mohali, and Panchkula. The elevated tracks are not just steel and concrete, they are pathways to a future where Chandigarh, Mohali, and Panchkula stand as beacons of innovation, sustainability, and inclusive growth. In the unfolding chapters of this transformative saga, the Metro Network emerges as a symbol of resilience, collaborative governance, and a commitment to a better future. With the wheels set in motion, and as the wheels of progress begin to turn, the Tricity anticipates a journey into a new era, an era defined by efficient connectivity, economic vibrancy, eco-friendly public transportation, and a commitment to a greener and more socially interconnected future for generations to come. Stay tuned for further developments on this project. Do let us know your thoughts on the subject in the comments section. My friend, if you have found any value in this video, then kindly click on like button as an encouragement to create better quality content. Please share this video amongst your family members, friends, and in your social media network so that this information might benefit others. Don't forget to subscribe to SciTech Buzz One channel so that you will not miss out on any of our forthcoming videos. Thank you.